this is second part of the series uh, the topic is raster data symbology so in this part we are going to apply proper symbol to DEM data so I'll use a part of uh, digital ele elevation model data converted to UTM projection and uh, downloaded from my own website and the original data is probably from Aster DEM so let us see the properties of the data so I am sorry the data is actually from Merit DEM from Tokyo University and it was accessed on 11th September 2020 and the data type is uh, TIFF file and the projection is EPSG32644 which it means it is WGS84 datum and UTM zone is 44N and its extent is uh, these coordinates and units are meters and width and height are here and the data type uh, is float 32 so this is 32 bit floating point and it has one single band and its cell size is 85.1.69 meter so uh, let us try to symbolize this elevation data so the same we use DEM UTM dot TIFF and drag and drop to the canvas now we can see that the default color used by QGIS is gray scale ranging from black is the lowest value and white is the highest value so white is 7000 meters and we can see that EPSC 32644 is the projection or coordinate reference system so now we will uh, rearrange the symbols so let us start so this is the symbology and render type is single band gray so we are going to change it to graduated color or single band pseudo color so if we change it to uh, this then it, it it looks quite good but let us try something different so we can use the color ramp and create a new color ramp okay now we use uh, different color for the minimum maximum and we add two more stops here so we can just double click somewhere uh, okay so we have th three different colors so this is black uh, green so we use blue color for the minimum value so if you select this one then we can change the color of this if we select this one we can change the color of this and similarly for all the stops we can change the colors so let us make the first stop uh, blue so we can put 0 
zero and two fifty five for the lowest color. So reverse will be represented as blue color. And next one we put green. So red and blue both are zero and green is the highest and then third stop we make it red so the color choice of color is uh, dependent on the convention and also the uh, personal choice Now it is red and last one we make it white. So the color ramp will be uh, will start from blue and gradually change to green and then it will change to red and finally it will look white. So this is our color ramp, OK and apply. So this is our color. So if you don't like this, then you can also choose different colors. Some are uh, available under this uh, like catalog CPTCT and it has already some uh, ramps available for different purpose for example for precipitation for temperature, for topography. So in this topography, if you see the there is DEM. So DEM starts from green and last value is white. So the QGIS, if you see, so in this elevation we can see that it is from uh, shine to black and the color uh, in between colors so if you like you can choose uh, any of these colors 